seat and like the seat post and how that mechanism actually there's a bolt and a in a in a, a nut. spring yeah and a spring, spring in there somehow and all this shit is all coming to him and shit and it's like oh my god this is and it's apparent to him that it's a specific design uh, element to fit into something. But some of the shit just goes beyond his ability to even understand what the, anything about it, like say like an, like a, like an MP3 player device (laughs) of your choice, something like that, where he, it's like, he's got the idea for the, the, the jog wheel and the fucking, you know, the, the, um, the jack for the headphones, like when they were still before blue, uh, before fully Bluetoothed, but like the three point five millimeter jack. It's got the two notches on it. Yeah, all that kind of shit. Those are all the ideas he's getting. It's not the it's not the main device. It's just all the stuff for it. And yeah, the bells and whistles. Yes, everything that makes it like tricked out and shit and he knows that they're all supposed to work together like these puzzle pieces but he just doesn't even know understand what the fuck this thing is supposed to do yeah I thought that was an interesting kind of idea like like for even like a short film or something or even Ben Franklin like he was imagining hooking the kite up with the metal wire to like a butt plug, a vibrating butt plug before they even, you know, existed. Yeah, see, and in that case, it was just his own personal weird fucking sexual proclivities and weirdnesses that drove that whole thing, and he discovered that if you tied the key up and fucking yada yada and conducted some electricity through the fucking, through the copper, that you could really singe your asshole and fucking, even to the point where you could almost cauterize that motherfucker shut if you didn't fucking stop riding the lightning. Literally. Ooh. And he hooked it up to like a pogo stick and just bounced around. Every time. But he was a really, um, he was a really uh, sadomasochist. You know, heavy masochist and shit. He loved the pain. It made him feel... It's kind of like... You ever watch his show, Drunk History? I've seen an episode or two, yes. That's what it reminds me of. Yeah. It's like, make shit up. (laughs) (laughs) Yes, truly. Well, all history is becoming like drunk history these days. I would say largely. That's why... Although I, I... I do love I do loves me some history. I also have a lot of contempt for it because it just seems like I like Uncle Remus's stories. Those are the best history books. Yeah, man, because they've they're they're closer to the truth. There's truth in that fucking art. Like it or lump it, motherfucker. There's truth in that art. Fucking hey, eat shit. That's why they fucking buried that shit because they were like, oh, we're so embarrassed, right? Oh shit fucking you were so fucking embarrassed about it that all those artists that worked on that motherfucking movie which was one of the first i think attempts at like live action slash animated mix fucking hybridizing shit all of the fucking technology that it took for that time to fucking 21 million dollars in today's money yeah you spent millions of motherfucking dollars Making that shit happen. So don't give me this I'm embarrassed fucking bullshit. Because that went through a lot of artists' hands. A lot of fucking actors. Animators. It went through fucking editing. It went through goddamn production of all kinds. Fuck off. But the but there's truth in that art. And that's what they did not care for. This whole big suppression attempt. What the fuck? <laughs> See? But that just goes to show you power and you know especially power plus tons of fucking money can make you rewrite history into a whitewashed fucking lame ass fucking attempt to make yourself not be the bad guy everybody or, or a brown wash ooh brown wash they're brown washing history nowadays yeah they are it's true how, how much time we get where are we at 49 and 55 seconds, 7 seconds, 8 seconds, 9 seconds, 
50 minutes. I have a feeling I'm going to be disrupted soon. Okay. Are there? Are there's there? Gonna be, there's going to be a disturbance in the forest. Are there forest. distant rumblings <laughs> on the horizon? Are the natives becoming restless? <laughs> All right. Well, that's fine. Do you want do you want to just make it a shorty like this, and we fucking call it a night? Yeah, that's all right. Well, then, that's a good, good, good shorty. All right. Well, then bear with me just a moment. I'm just gonna switch over here, and I'm going to um I'm just gonna sign off with the with the theme song here. I just had to do a little switcheroo. Each generation gets a shorter attention span, so as the years go by, we got to shorten our Huh, what'd you say? Cast. I'm sorry, I wasn't so paying don't, attention. What? Don't lose interest. <laughs> I'm sorry, I was not paying attention. What'd you say? <laughs> Son of a bitch! I said as each year goes by... I was we... just kidding, sir. <laughs> but it is the truth. <laughs> I hear yeah. you. I'll tell you again. Yeah. Uh, hey, let's, let's, let's start repeating ourselves. Why not? I think we have a few times throughout the podcast history anyway. All right, man, here we go. All right, everybody. Well, thank you very much for um, hanging with us on our... <laughs> Jesus Christ. Wow. Hi. How you doing? On our first episode of the year. And, you know, we are optimistic about hopes and changes and changes for hopes and hoping for change and changing while hoping and hoping while changing and hoping that the changing will lead to more hopeful change in a changeful, hopeful future. But you know, it all sounds like shit to me. <laughs> you know this will be another goddamn year of the same shit. Except more bitches. <laughs> There'll be a lot more bitches out there. Going, you should, you should, this, that, no more shots. Let's get seven, let's get eight. Why not? Lay in the box. That's what you goddamn want. Then lay it in. But if you think you're going to root out people based on their fucking dissenting opinion, you can eat shit. Anyway, what, what? Were, you, what were you saying? I'm, I'm afraid I cut you off. <laughs> And a happy new year. <laughs> well, that's the hope and the change, you see. <laughs> because what I said was, you will not be rooting people out just for their dissenting opinions. You can eat shit. I read this article. Yeah, you're always welcome to dissent upon yeah, what we man. say. Dissent all over it, man. That's cool. I'll dissent on your dissent. That's cool, and we can have a big descent off. I like that. That I'm down with. No, I was just read this. I was reading this stupid ass article. Something I rarely do. I read articles on the internet. It's garbage. All of it. <clears throat> it almost made me puke. But what I want to say about that is this. I was reading this idiotic article about, about this retired fuckhead general dickwad who was, like, shitting all over people, saying that blah, 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 the Proud Boys, fucking Trump supporter, this, that, and the other, uh, responsible for the January 6th fucking insurrection and this, that, and the other, and how um, Trump supporters specifically, and the article, of course, was talking about some CNN bullshit all over it, and it was in the fucking Daily Mail garbage fucking dumpster fire. Yeah, I think I read something like that, too, and I got about maybe a quarter of the way through it. Yeah, and it just kept, it just, it bullet pointed everything in the beginning, and then it just, the paragraphs were just like, just very, very slightly expanded bullet points that they had already said, so they kept repeating the same things. But they always said Trump. They didn't say former President Trump or any of that shit. They kept caught just saying Trump. And I think any fucking any publication that's worth really fucking paying attention to at all will not do that. Because the man, whether you liked him or didn't like him, is is beside the point. Well, you know what drives me nuts, fucking nuts is when they'll like have like a Twitter feed 
mm-hmm. from somebody, mm-hmm. like a screenshot of it or whatever, <clears throat> and they'll they'll like say what's in the Twitter feed, and then they'll put the Twitter feed under it, which says the exact same thing. Yeah. And then they repeat it like a third time sometimes what it says. So you end up reading the same shit like three times in a row. And that's what this article was like. And you're like, what the... F-? To make it look longer or something. I don't know. Yeah. Man, but it's like, yeah. So they just... Why, could, why couldn't they just insert it in there rather than like repeat it when it's already written and inserted? You know what I'm saying? Well, that's the thing. It's like, here's the title, here's the byline, <clears throat> and then they bullet point it really quick and then go on to fucking just add one or two words to the bullet points as a paragraph like motherfucker i got it i guess i got what you basically wanted me to understand uh uh, in the beginning here but yeah i kept reading the shit and and the dude's like retired general fuckwad says fucking uh we should root out trump supporters out of the military because they're a threat from within and all this shit we should root them out and get them out of the ranks and all this stuff i was like what that really sounds like like persecution, like political persecution, which wasn't that one of the stupid ass things that they bullshitted us into believing that the fucking uh, the Constitution and the pilgrims came here for or all this shit. Yeah. Okay. So. These yeah, freedom of speech, freedom of fucking. Uh... Religion, freedom of uh, thought, you know, fucking... And of course, this dumbass thing was on fucking retard books, so I fucking... I go on there, I'm just like, why would anyone give a fuck what this clown says at all? I said, he's he's retired from the military now, so what, he gets to talk all this shit about it all he wants? Oh, okay. Well, what if you worked for fucking McDonald's? Do you think I'd give a fuck about your stupid-ass fucking... What the, the shit you know about the McDonald's fucking uh, executive branch? You think I'd give a fuck about that either, you whining crybaby fuckface? Now that you're now that you're free from being fucking fucked with and your career and everything else that was given to you by the American people and the military in combination, now that you've gotten that yeah, and the right, yeah, the people on the right, you know, part of your fucking career, yeah, and now you're fucking saying root these people out and fucking get them out of the ranks and shit and fucking banish them and all this shit. What the fuck? But who are you talking to? The Communist News Network, man. You know, fucking hey. You know, you're talking to CNN and shit, telling them about how fucking much of a fuckhead Trump was, I guess. Because he keeps saying Trump. So, not only are you a fucking retired general cockwad, but this man... Yeah, it sounds like you're calling him out. This man who was your former boss... Yeah, general cocksucker, I think. Or... General Champ fucking Commander. (laughs) General Commander (laughs) Champ cocksucker. (laughs) Yeah. (laughs) This fucking asshole. I'm like, I'm like, what else did I say? Something like fucking, I don't know. I'm like, this fucking, this man is a fucking fool and possibly a traitor. You know, I'm like, maybe he should be looked (laughs) into. My fucking (laughs) comments and shit. Just lighting him on fire. Everybody else was like, well, you know, and then Trump said. I'm like, who is this fucking asshole that, you know? I said, first of all, it's fucking, it's CNN, so who gives a shit? Fucking fake news. And yeah, yes, they're you fucking, they're, play, play they're ambulance out. chasers. Remember, they, they started on the, when they bombed fucking uh, Kuwait, right? That's how they got their start. Yeah, the fucking the 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 three minute volley of uh, missiles launched that we watched. Yeah, over I remember over. seeing that. All you saw was like these lights kind of streaked across the yeah. sky, and it was like that's you're know, like that's a war. What the fuck is that? And it kept looking like the same piece of footage that was only about yeah, 40, was 45 like seconds. It looked or like a fireworks minute. popping off and shit. The one minute war because it just kind of kept yeah. looping and shit. Yeah, they'd always show the same shit. Fuck yeah, they did. I mean, I'm sure a lot more happened, but that's all. And that's all they ever do. They repeat the same images, you know. They just have, like, a limited... They're like, we sold you a war on 45 seconds worth of footage. Yeah. Laughed at it. Look at that shit. They think this is how it went down. You know, granted, it was only, like, fucking... It felt like only a few days, really. (laughs) That we stomped their ass so fucking fast and hard, they were like, okay, sorry. Yeah. 
They tasted that shit. Cooked 